I'd like to point out this unique fuel priming system aboard this diesel boat. You can see here we've got this hose with the squeeze bulb from an outboard motor going over to a valve there and down there that have closed off this external loop and then the fuel coming from the Raycor filter or from the uh, fuel supply coming up this line into these filters which are the Cummins brand Fleet Guard diesel fuel filters. The point I want to make is that squeeze bulb is not certified for below deck use. That's an outboard squeeze bulb for gasoline and this hose right here you can see a little bubble moving back and forth in it that's full of cranberry colored off-road diesel fuel and that is not a certified fuel hose. Looking to the left a little bit, you can see this bulb over here. It's rock hard. It's old. It's rock hard. And again, we've got this hose up here that's not a certified fuel hose. And back here in the back, you can see it's valved off at the top, valved off at the bottom. And the fuel from the tank is coming up through this line, through that open valve, going into those fleet guard filters. So although this is a great idea in principle, it is not an accepted idea in practice. So if you're thinking about putting outboard squeeze bulbs below decks in a boat, it's not a good idea. If you want to learn how to change fuel filters, like these Cummins brand Fleet Guard fuel filters, or the traditional Raycor fuel filter, just remember, ask Captain Chris.